a presentation of the United States Fish and Wildlife Service. Kenai National Wildlife Refuge in South Central Alaska encompasses nearly two million acres of the magnificent Kenai Peninsula. The peninsula descends gracefully from glaciers in the 6,000 foot Kenai Mountains. These mountains are the source of numerous rivers, including the world famous Kenai River, which flows through forested lowlands to Cook Inlet. Hundreds of lakes reflect lowland spruce and birch forests. Within this beautiful natural setting resides an abundance of wildlife from splendid salmon to majestic moose. President Franklin Roosevelt established the refuge as the Kenai National Moose Range in 1941. The Moose Range protected seriously declining moose populations. In 1980, the Alaska National Interest Lands Conservation Act changed the name to Kenai National Wildlife Refuge and adjusted the boundaries. The act expanded the primary purpose of the refuge to include conserving all wildlife and their habitats. The refuge is one of 16 national wildlife refuges in Alaska. The refuge's main objective is conserving fish and wildlife populations and habitats in their natural diversity. Other purposes include preserving more than a million acres of wilderness, protecting water quality, and providing education and recreation opportunities to the public. The Kenai Refuge is often called Alaska in miniature because its ecosystems and diverse wildlife reflect those of the entire state. The refuge conserves vital habitat for a diversity of wildlife, Mountain snow fields and glaciers are sources of fresh water that wildlife and people need to survive. Alpine tundra is home to doll sheep and golden eagles. Spruce forests mixed with birch, aspen, and cottonwood provide homes for moose, black bear, and spruce grouse. Wetlands are essential for the survival of migratory waterfowl, brown bears, and salmon. Geographic and climatic conditions have an island effect on the Kenai Peninsula. The subarctic climate allows only a short growing season for plants to mature and new plants to take hold. Disturbance can set delicate plant species back several years. 
preserving wilderness is another of the refuge's purposes. Animals like brown bears, wolves, lynx, and trumpeter swans require large habitat areas and are sensitive to human activities. To ensure the survival of these animals, Congress designated more than a million acres of the Kenai Refuge as wilderness. Each year, the refuge hosts a variety of education and recreation activities for 500,000 visitors. Information and education programs help the public learn about wildlife ecology and resource issues that are critical to refuge survival. Through greater understanding of wildlife, the public can help to conserve wildlife and refuge resources. Visitors enjoy a variety of recreational activities year-round, including camping, photography, wildlife viewing, fishing, and hunting. From lake to stream, each body of water has its own fish story. Sport fishing is a popular activity, and the most sought-after species include rainbow trout, dolly varden, and four kinds of salmon. Fishing from a boat is often more successful than bank fishing. Using a boat helps protect shorelines from erosion and prevent siltation, providing clean, slower moving water young fish need to survive. Hikers find short day hikes in the Ski Lack Wildlife Recreation Area an excellent way to stretch their muscles and enjoy beautiful mountaintop vistas. Experienced hikers prepare wisely. Hikers should always be safety conscious in bear country. Hike with others, make noise in brushy areas, and watch for signs of bears like scat, tracks, or freshly clawed trees. Canoeing the Dave Spencer Wilderness Unit is a great escape from summer crowds. Canoeists work their way through a system of portages and connecting lakes along the Swan Lake and Swanson River canoe trails. Hunting activity is greatest from mid-August through September when hunters pursue doll sheep, caribou, and moose. Smaller game popular with hunters include spruce grouse and waterfowl. The Ski Lack Wildlife Recreation Area is a special refuge management area where hunting is limited to promote wildlife observation and photography for the public. In winter, frozen lakes and waterways become trails and routes for exploration. Visitors and local residents enjoy cross-country skiing, snowshoeing, and ice fishing. Snowmobiling is a favorite pursuit when deep snow provides travel opportunities. While the majority of the refuge is open to snowmobile travel, closed areas exist for quiet winter sports and to protect fragile alpine habitat. Seeing a moose or a bald eagle perched on a treetop are special benefits of a winter outing on the refuge. Wildlife does not recognize agency or political boundaries. It moves freely throughout the Kenai Peninsula. As human populations expand and demand more natural resources and space, wildlife habitat is steadily lost, fragmented, or compromised. Our major challenge is to protect our wildlife and to fulfill the purposes for which the refuge was established. We work to understand the needs of wildlife and to manage for their success. Through our management programs, wildlife populations are conserved and their habitats improved. Refuge staff, volunteers, community members, and visitors work together for the benefit of the refuge. Our combined efforts will create a legacy for Kenai National Wildlife Refuge as a place where salmon runs are healthy, brown bears thrive, and wolves continue to roam the wilderness. <laughs>